Look at you guys. You guys are like everywhere. Yeah, you're always matching. It's pretty cool. You guys were uh, one of the most powerful people in daytime, right? We, we you I know, we're number Congrats. 21. And 21's Congrats. a lucky number. 21 is so, a lucky number. You know, we're, we're quite thrilled with that. Congrats. That's awesome. <laughs> so how are you doing? I'm doing great. Good, good. I'm doing great. Um, Luke has been um, really called out on some of his hypocrisy this last week, in a way. Some of his judgments about his mother's reactions to grief. Um, yes. Both Lily and Noah have pointed out that Luke himself has made judgments at times. Yes, yes, I think Luke has been called out, but I also think that, um, I think Luke was pretty level-headed in, in, with what happened with, uh, Damien and Lily, because he immediately admitted that, you know, that he had, he, he had very strong feelings about their recent union, but, um, I think he came, he came around, and, you know, like, even though he's upset with what his mother did, he's not being the bratty kid who screams at his mom and screams at her, and he did accept her, you know, and forgive her. Is that different from when you first started playing Luke? Do you think he's reacting differently now than he would have a few years ago? Yeah, I mean, he still doesn't really think, think things through, I guess, but, um, he's getting a little better. Yeah. A little better. Yeah. It seems like he's not too, at least so far, not too jealous of this whole no amazing thing. I know, not yet at least. Not yet. Not yet at least. That um, will come to a head, uh, I think, in the next month or so. Uh -huh. um, and it segues into what our next storyline is, which is very, very interesting. Anything you can tell us about that? It's, honestly, I think Jake is amazingly talented, but this is some of the, the best work I've seen him do. Wow, good. Good. Um, what brings you here today? Is this, do you have personal attachments to, to helping out? Or? Well, I mean, Broadway Cares Equity Fund Fights AIDS is an awesome uh, organization that, you know, I've, I've actually, I was the uh, head of AIDS action in high school, and um, so I've known about this this cause for a, a very long time, and we, we've, you know, I have lots of friends in the Broadway community, and it's great that they inv involve the daytime community, um, and it's a great cause, you know. Um, I think especially with AIDS awareness, it's something that this, in this day and age, is kind of not swept under the rug, but it's not the way it was when it first came out, and there's not the attention to it um, and people you know people talk about h1n1 or whatever all this all these new disasters and new you know terrible plagues that are happening but but this has been a plague for the last almost 30 years now I think in 81 is when went, you yeah. know so it's it's been killing you know so many people and it's not in the news the way it should be so anything that you know helps helps fight fight it is, is I think very important seems like you do a a lot to help out charities and a lot to do to help this world. Well, I, I, I don't, I mean, that's very nice of you to say. I guess I noticed you more <laughs> at these things and that's some... Well, I mean, I think there's important, you know, this is important stuff to be done, you know. On another note, we were just we were at the Emmys. We saw yes. you there. We were disappointed. Oh, that's all How right. How are you doing with that? Uh, well, the uh, the the uncontrollable shaking stopped about last week. Uh, I still wake up in panics and night sweats, but uh, besides besides that, I'm okay. I guess I mean it's silly to ask you if you were disappointed, but I mean, of you course, think? you know, I would have loved to win, but also, you know, like it's an award. Mm -hmm. You know, it's. It's an award. It's it's a fantastic little icing on the cake, but as I say very lamely, the cake is what I get to do every day. You know? Yeah. Okay. Is there anything else you'd like to say? Um, anything else you'd like to say about our fu the future of, of your story or? Uh, well, I think um, I think uh, I think there's some good stuff coming up. I think there's some very good stuff coming up. Good. I always enjoy talking with you, Van. My pleasure. Thank you so much. Oh, thank you so oh, much. Thank you.